This is Carol Cox. I'm down here at 4th Street Mall, Think Tech Hawaii, and uh, we're just asking people along the way about these proposed rules that the governor is considering allowing the DOBAR, the Department of Boating and Recreation, DLNR, to actually shoot cats or kill them in any manner that they desire. It's pretty horrible. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, that seems extremely inhumane and immoral. Are you a cat owner or a pet owner? Pet owner, not cat. Okay. I have a dog. But uh, yeah, this is the, the concern is that they want to sign this bill, want the governor to sign this bill and be able to just shoot, poison, trap, euthanize, anything. Oh, that just, it sounds completely awful. Wow, I can't believe that they would propose such a thing. A reason, I mean, aren't there um, stuff where you can get animals off the streets and put them in like Shelter. A project, yeah, shelters, and then if no one wants them, then do what we've been doing for years by putting them to sleep if nobody wants to adopt them or take care of them. So you, th you would vote on the side of... Um, it's inhumane in a certain way. It's like, if you don't want us shooting people on the streets, why are you going to go and shoot a living thing? It's also, I mean, I guess we hunt also, like deer or whatever, but I mean, it's kind of wrong. Well, I think they should issue permits to the hunters or whatever. <laughs> issue permits to the hunters? Yeah. And, and then not, not do the random killing. And not that. just randomly kill yeah. them? Yeah, yeah. Okay. And, and, then, and, and, and not let the, uh, uh, the uh, animals uh, rot. Rot. And I then, think that's part of the controversy. Uh, and, no, I don't, I don't think they should just be able to go free range hunting cats. Okay. I think there's a better alternative. What, more kind of, what would you suggest to them to do? I don't know what they do now, mm -hmm. um, but I don't know if there's any kind of group or coalition that goes around and, you know, cages mm -hmm. them or someone who would, you know, like the Humane Society, you can call it. I don't so. agree with that. I have three cats myself and they were all, they're all feral. I got them fixed through Popoki and, um, you know, there's ways to, to get them fixed um, where you poi don't have to spend, popoki. yeah, poi dogs and Popoki, mm -hmm. and they, they fixed my cats and they're happy cats now. So, mm -hmm. I mean, they're, they're still living, they're still living, you know, animals that we, we have to take care of and, and I don't agree in shooting, shooting oh. them to get rid of them, but, but like, we, I think we have to take care of the problem of um, them multiplying by by taking them to those nonprofit organizations like Poi Dog and Popoki, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and everybody do their part to um, take care of the matter that way. Uh, well, I think there needs to be humanity with it, so they need to be. I'm not in favor of just shooting animals. Uh, I I definitely wouldn't promote shooting them. There are, of course, other ways to prevent, as you say, neutering them, catching them in wilds. Um, mm -hmm. I've caught a few litters myself and turned them in um, just to kind of help promote. But there's a lot of other methods that we can look at, I think, in terms of reducing the population. So your suggestion to the governor be do not sign it and consider other humane methods? Is that could be safe to say? Yes, absolutely. Okay. Uh, we're just getting some uh, opinions and comments from various people, and we're going to close with this. Please give consideration to being humane in the addressment of the population of cats in the boat harbors and anywhere else. If you have cats or have dogs, please treat them humanely, as well as if you find that you can't keep them any longer, do the right thing. Turn them into the Humane Society or find another home for them, but don't, please don't, just leave them because... With the new rules being proposed, if they are signed, then they will meet a fate that is inhumane, be killed if they find themselves in the docks or the harbors, they will be killed by the State Department of Boating and Recreation or its agents or its representatives.